All right, so today we're making a new type of bread. This is double O pizza flour, but it's what they're calling for. And it's that name right there. I don't know how to pronounce it. But it's a crisp, chewy Italian bread from Tuscany. And I have a video on here from back, I think, in March of the 2024 that we did a Tuscan sandwich bread that was divine. So it's going to take about two hours all total. And we're just getting done here. I'm waiting to see if my yeast is growing. And it is. I just saw one pop. This is some really fresh yeast. I just opened the bag. So, from here I'm going to add in um, olive oil and kosher salt. So I have to have, um, and I got my machine on, grams, 25 grams of oil. And I have some Greek oil, 25 grams. Pour slowly, stop, pour a little more, 25 grams. And just another little plop. Oh, a little over. It's going to have a lot of olive oil put on it, so I think that'll be okay. Now we'll tear that out again, and we're going to put in 7 grams of salt. It does not want to come out. And I already have 450 grams of flour. So turn that off. I just have to stir it by hand. And then put it on the KitchenAid. No. I'm doing this by one hand. I don't have it on my tripod. And there we go. Next up is, uh, you see, we're skipping two with the wooden spoon. We're skipping three, turn the dough onto a clean surface. And we're skipping four all the way down to dough mixer, dough hook. Five minutes at high speed. You gotta be careful the flour doesn't come flying out at you. Five minutes at high speed, then two minutes at low. I'm looking at all my sides. And all my sides clean. That side just about clean. There we go. Then I gotta just put it in an oiled bowl and let it rest for till it doubles or for one hour and ten minutes. So we'll be back after it gets done resting. Well, I didn't even remember to turn my phone on, but I got my dough out, and I have it in this nice little new, I just bought this new baking thing. It's green. I don't know if it's really picking it up or not. It looks more blue, but oh, it's a beautiful green. It's from Portugal. 
I love Portugal pottery. Anyway, so I put it in there. And I'm on step number... Um, nine. I transferred it to an oiled baking sheet. Covered it loosely with plastic wrap. Got my timer on 20 minutes. And I turned my oven on to 425 to warm up. Then when it gets done, I'll brush it with light oil. And I'll squish it down. And then I'll stick it in the oven and bake it. Yeah. I'll hopefully remember to record that. All right, folks, we're back. This is risen. It looks delicious. We're going to pour some oil over the top. More olive oil. And it said to spread it. So it's all over. There we go. Sure, it's on the edges of the pan. Then the fun part, you get to do this. It said to make sure you go all the way to the bottom. There we go. Now we're going to cook it for 20 to 25 minutes. Timer is set. Oops, not 43. Not 12. Twenty-five minutes. And I'll come back when it comes up. 